Less than a month after opening, Beaumont's newest bar and restaurant, the Park on Calder, appears to be booming. But neighbors in Old Town feel like they're the ones left hosting the after party. Good evening. The park was plunged into the news headlines with that deadly shooting in an alley earlier this month. That incident concerns neighbors, but they're also worried about parking, trash and rowdy customers. 12 News reporter Kyle Orr is here tonight and Kyle, they took their concerns straight to City Council this week. That's right, Jordan. The park on Calder is undoubtedly seeing early success, but residents nearby have voiced their complaints about customers disturbing the peace and causing problems off the park's property. Calder Avenue serves as the home to one of Beaumont's newest and most popular bars. They're doing a great job over there. Uh, they're bringing the crowds in. But some neighbors are fed up with the behavior of the park's customers outside of the property. The problem is the parking in the neighborhood for the overflow from their parking lot. Uh, my concern is the safety and the cleanliness of the neighborhood. John Fears owns Calder Cleaners just up the block. We have people parking in private parking lots. We have them using the restroom in parking lots. We have them using the restroom on the sidewalks. We have cars double parked, creating problems for egress for emergency vehicles, both on 8th Street and Calder. But Fears and the park's representatives can agree on one thing. Uh, these things are out of the park's realm and uh, capability of taking care of, so it's kind of pushed over to some city problems that need to be addressed. They told council members it's time for the city to step in. Now, this might be a good business venture. It might be a good economic venture, but it's hell and terror to the people that live in close proximity. Joshua Moore from the park admits it's a challenging scenario. We do not have any control over what happens as people, our patrons leave the park on call to us. So I do want to be clear on that, as well as where they park and things of that nature. So what does the city plan to do about the problem? I think a good idea would be that maybe we can do a town hall, possibly at the park, and I don't mind coming in support of that and allow the neighbors of the old town neighborhood to come to the town hall and we can see what we can do to work together to solve this problem. We reached out to Beaumont Police, to, to the Beaumont Police Department, but they were unable to comment on the ongoing situation. We'll follow up if we learn more. Live in the studio, Kyle Orr, 12 News.